We're here today because last fall my office convened a roundtable discussion on the state of California's homeless children, um, which included state departments, advocates, and stakeholders. During those discussions, we found out that roughly 200,000 children are considered homeless in California. This is simply unacceptable in a state that has the world's fifth largest economy. My legislation establishes a comprehensive policy approach to help communities identify homeless children, many of which are children of color. Not only does this bill fund new homeless coordinator positions at the Department of Education, because right now we really only have one person that coordinates this statewide, but we're also going to create new regional assistance centers for communities who need additional help. We have a lot of work to do. Uh, and this bill, AB 16, really helps to move us in the direction of how we support them. Uh, the California Department of Education is deeply committed to what this bill proposes, the resources that would be used to um, help access more resources, to work with school districts to avail themselves to the McKinney Vento program, which is a way of helping homeless youth get more resources and services. Um, we're completely committed to it. This is very personal to me. You know, my own elementary school where I attended and is in my district, 24% um, of the children are considered homeless. Um, and that's unacceptable. And these are kids that are living in cars, motels, um, or crowded up in a garage. Uh, and it's uh, something that, when I heard about it and, and saw the numbers, I immediately thought this is something that I have to do work on as an assembly member.